Kuma Inu is getting ready to moon. What's up guys, how's it going? Zoltaev here, aka John. Kuma Inu is getting ready to go ahead and moon, but before I do go ahead and talk about, about it in this video and I do my TA on why it's going to moon, I do want to go ahead and say I am not a financial advisor. Anything I do say or talk about in this video is solely for entertainment purposes only, all right guys? Only invest in what you're willing to lose. Uh, this is a very scary market. So let's go ahead and go straight to the charts and then check out Kuma, see what's going on. So if you guys are not aware, you guys will be sleeping under or living under a rock, right? Sleeping under a rock would work as well. Um, if you guys are definitely not hearing what's going on with Shiba or Kuma, you guys definitely have to go ahead and wake up and take advantage of this opportunity that is currently going on right now. So as you guys can go ahead and tell, We've been pretty much on a downtrend with the whole market as well with uh, with Kuma. We you know we ended up consolidating here for a while. We've been in a downtrend for the past about three months. We are very late to the bull run, which is one of the reasons why I do think that Kuma and any other crypto right now at the moment is definitely going to go to the upside. So uh, before I do go ahead and get started, I do want to go ahead and mention our sponsor, Metafest 2022. All right, guys, so go ahead and make sure you guys do go ahead and check out Metafest 2022. It's going to be a massive project. So go ahead and definitely check them out and follow them on Twitter. Stay up to date. So let's go ahead and get started with Kuma. So Kuma is going to go ahead and pump very soon. If you guys are not aware, it does move very closely with uh, with Shiba. So this will definitely be a project. For me personally, I think Shiba is, I wouldn't call it overvalued, but I kind of feel like the, the hype train is over for Shiba. If you guys would have jumped in onto Shiba very soon, very early of last year when it was in the complete red, then you guys would have been taking massive you know, opportunity to the upside and as well with uh jumping in during those times but right now yeah you can go ahead and make money but you're not going to make nothing insane with shiba inu at all i think it's already too late i always have this um i wouldn't call it a trick but i always say if someone you're not if okay let's go ahead and say this again if there's someone that you know that has no idea what crypto is and comes to you asking you about shiba inu that's how you know you're late to the party. So you definitely do not want to be jumping in into a project that everybody and their mom and grandma are literally talking about. Like I could walk down the street and I could count a handful of people that know what Shiba and Deutschcoin is, right? So is that good? Yes, it could be good. But for me, I think it's just the opportunity is kind of gone. I'm not saying you're not going to make money on Kuma. I mean, sorry, on Shiba. You definitely are but you're not going to make life-changing wealth but then it then again it depends what life-changing money is to you right you know to some people it might be 10 grand 20 grand 100 grand half a million two million so it just all depends but for me personally i was in shiba i exited and i went into kuma because it does move very closely and it is the same developer so i do see a bigger upside with Kuma since less people know about it. And I definitely say that's a good advantage to go ahead and jump in now. So when we do begin to go ahead and get that hype like Shiba, that's when you're going to be making massive insane gains. So let's go ahead and look at the four hourly. Let's go ahead and stop talking. So we definitely did break our resistance that we had very strong resistance, which was right here, this purple line, which is a 0.13. We did break above it. So right now we do definitely need to go ahead and look at this resistance right here, which I would say would be right here. We've been kind of struggling in that area to go ahead and break above it. So we definitely do want to go ahead and, and break above it, but we are currently oversold, oh, sorry, overbought on the four hourly. So do expect it to go ahead and drop down right here to 0.16 and possibly go ahead and bounce back up if we are in an uptrend. Bitcoin is looking pretty good so far, so I do believe that's going to happen. But do expect this to possibly go ahead and drop like this and then move into to the upside, right? So that's on the four hourly chart. Let's go ahead and look at the daily. 
So the daily is barely about to go ahead and hit over an overbought territory. So you guys do have to definitely keep in mind that everything continues to run in forever. We definitely do always want to see a healthy pullback just in order to go ahead and continue to the upside. So like I said, we could possibly go ahead and break to the upside, then create a new support. Or as well, what we could go ahead and do is break above it, which we are kind of struggling right now. We might end up pushing through by tomorrow and then possibly bounce back right here around this area. Once we do go ahead and bounce from that area, healthy pullback and then up to the upside, which is super bullish. I think that's what might happen. I'm not here to go ahead and tell you what's exactly going to happen, but TA just gives you a prediction of the possibility of what will happen. So let's go ahead and look at that weekly chart right now. So the weekly chart is looking extremely bullish. It's looking just as good as the Bitcoin chart. And if you guys are not aware, um, like I did mention, Kuma does move with Shiba and then Shiba usually tends to move and Bitcoin does good as well, right? So a lot of these projects are kind of back to back to one another, but it is definitely time to go ahead and jump to the upside. So you guys can go ahead and definitely, if you guys do jump in, which right now would be a good buying opportunity, not financial advice, you guys could easily expect 200 to 300% um, easily. It could definitely, of course, go higher, but that is just assuming benefit of the doubt, you know, the lowest. So, but like I said, I do definitely see a bigger upside. We will be making you up to, uh, sorry, we will be making you all time highs. So just go ahead and keep that in mind. I'm very extremely bullish. This project, if you guys are new to the channel, this project with Kuma only has about 24,000 holders. So I'll go ahead and show you guys that right now. So we're about only 24,000 holders. And our market cap is about 25 million. So we're looking pretty good. And we have a total liquidity of about 8 million. So it's looking very solid. I do definitely go ahead and think we do have a massive, you know, pump to the upside. And let's go ahead and check out Shiba real quick, see how that's doing, because it does move very closely with this project as well. So Shiba, you could definitely, I'm not sure if you guys noticed that, but very similar patterns compared to Kuma with Shiba. And like I said, obviously, because the same developer, so it does follow one another, which is really good. And as well right now with Shiba, we do definitely want to go ahead and see it break, I would call resistance area around right here. So we're on resistance about now. So that would be the resistance. And then we'll go ahead and call this a support. Pretty strong support right there. The whole goal is to definitely go ahead and make resistance, then become a support. So to go ahead and have a healthy pullback, we definitely want to go ahead and have it break above, consolidate or whatever the case is, and then hop back up. That's what makes it healthy. So always keep that in, in mind, guys. Don't think we're going to go you know, to the moon forever. As much as I always want it to just continue to moon, it's not going to happen. So that's looking at the daily chart. Now let's go ahead and switch over to the four hourly. So the four hourly, we are getting close to breaking that resistance. Like I once said, if you guys want to go ahead and jump into Shiba, which I do not know why you guys would when you guys have Kuma to go ahead and jump into, but, um, you know, whatever excites you and makes you happy, right? Not financial advice. These videos are only for educational purposes only. So at the end of the day, you guys can go ahead and do what you guys see value in and what you guys uh, want to go ahead and, you know, invest in. So this is the weekly chart looking extremely bullish. I really do think what's going to happen. It's the same, almost similar chart to what's going on with Bitcoin. We could definitely go ahead and see an upside like that and just moon, possibly go ahead and create, uh, create a cup and handle, probably find its support around right here consolidate for a while and then moon once again, make new all time highs. So that's what's probably most likely going to happen with these projects. So, um, you know, I do definitely feel bullish with how the market is reacting and I do want to go ahead and talk about another project that I did talk about, about a few videos ago, a few days ago, the project is called Sirachi Inu. It is in the pack with all these uh, dog coins, but the nice thing about this is that it runs on 
B and B, which means usually gas fees, you don't have to worry about it. But um, this project had a massive pump today. It actually jumped as high as 800%. And what causes news was uh, an influencer called Dell Crypto actually tweeted about this project today and pretty much moon. If you guys are not aware, Sirachi Inu is part of MetaFest 2022. So that is very exciting. They are going to be at the event. So, you know, uh, just go ahead and be aware of what's going on. And this is the reason why, you know, being subscribed to her channel, liking and comment down below. You guys could go ahead and get access to these projects before anybody knows. So go ahead and make sure to subscribe. Our channel is not going to be low key like this forever. We are having a discord right now at the moment that is currently free that will be a premium version later down the future and all of you guys will be able to have access to the projects that we talk about before anybody finds out about the project so that gives you a better higher opportunity because you definitely do not want to jump into a project and miss a pump like this i've been calling about a pump for the last few days when i first made the video i said buy sriracha in you guys it's going to go ahead and make some massive gains. I never knew this was going to happen, but um, this was a lot more than what I expected it to pump, but it pumped, right? So like I said, guys, you guys would only be aware if you guys are subscribed to the channel. So, you know, Sriracha Inu is looking very solid right now. I really like the developers. Team super solid. If you guys can tell, we definitely did break above that resistance point so we are looking pretty good right now to go ahead and expect this to be uh you know a definitely a solid healthy pullback you guys definitely do want to go ahead and have it you know uh, take a dip possibly you could dip down to these areas right here consolidate for a while and then moon back up and make new all-time highs i mean the whole market's going to the moon guys so definitely go ahead and look into that. Let's go ahead and see what the hourly chart is looking at. Like right now at the moment, look at that right there. The one hourly, I said it's in a find a support and it's in a bounce back up. So maybe by tomorrow, uh, you know, this project can continue to go ahead and, and moon, honestly. Like we might just go ahead and see it consolidate or maybe not even consolidate, just straight up moon or drop for a while. You really can't predict this, but what I could definitely go ahead and say that this project is going to moon even higher. I don't even think it's over yet. The party is getting just started and so is crypto getting started at the moment. I am I am feeling very confident with how the market's looking, but we'll go ahead and see how this week ends. Just go ahead and keep in mind we are having the Super Bowl this week, I believe. And, you know, there's going to be a lot of commercials right now with crypto.com and whatnot. So I think this project and all of these cryptos are going to moon. We were at about 1,200 holders a few days ago when I mentioned this project, and we currently are at about 1,800 holders. So definitely, I do see this project pumping up even higher to the upside. It is going to be coming out on MetaFest 2022, which is on March. We're very excited for that, but just go ahead and keep an eye on this project, guys. Like I said, Huge potential. Another project I do want to kind of go ahead and touch bases on a bit. It is Ka Shinobi. I did kind of talk and mention on the previous video that there was going to be a retracement and I pretty much called it. You know, for the most part, I'm usually always correct. <laughs> you know, um, my TA is usually on point. Unlike a lot of these other YouTubers that run on emotions, I clearly called this support area right here i told everybody if you guys were looking to go ahead and jump in definitely watch out and wait for it to bounce for a while and then see how it holds so this might become the new support but to really go ahead and find out it just depends on how it's going to hold if it does drop below we could definitely go ahead and see it support down right here to the downside which is this 0.6 area but if it does hold up pretty well break that resistance we could go ahead and see an upside as well so these projects look very similar to Zuzzle a Cup and Handle pattern. So this is what's probably happening right here. And it's going to moon. So there you guys go. Uh, definitely go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll go ahead and keep you guys updated. And before I do go ahead and forget, 
It's probably a little too late now, running into 14 minutes, but we do have an event going on with Kuma Inu that we are working very closely with the team. So go ahead and catch us on Telegram. I'll go ahead and put the description down in, in the, I'll go ahead and put the link down in the description and as well, join our Discord channel. I'll go ahead and keep all of you guys updated, all right? You guys have a good one. I'll see you on Wednesday or Tuesday. <laughs> you guys have a good one. Take care. What is that? It's red and gooey and it, uh... Ah! Did, did, did it just move? No! Get away from me! Ah!